My name is Robert Hamm, and I was a combat videographer for the Army. We've been out here for many, many days. This is footage from my tour to Afghanistan, where the U.S. government worked closely with Afghan interpreters to defeat the Taliban and rebuild their country. Many interpreters were promised a special immigrant visa to the United States in exchange for their service. But those visas, in almost every case, have yet to come. As the U.S. leaves Afghanistan, interpreters are left behind and are killed by the Taliban. This is my interpreter from that tour. His name and his face have been hidden because he too is being hunted by the Taliban. The Interpreter is a short narrative film based on real events that have been fictionalized to protect interpreters whose lives are in danger. The UN estimates that one interpreter is killed every 36 hours in Afghanistan. This interpreter is one of thousands who served the US honorably and he has waited over seven years for his special immigrant visa. There are an estimated 8,000 interpreters in Afghanistan still waiting for their visas as they evade the Taliban. We have put together a team to make a short narrative film that exposes this issue with the intent of putting pressure on policymakers and getting visas to the interpreters as promised. The interpreter follows Farooq Hakmali, an Afghan interpreter who is receiving death threats daily as the army unit he's with prepares to leave Afghanistan. The clock is ticking, and if Farouk and his family don't make it out before the platoon leaves, they will certainly die at the hands of the Taliban. The platoon leader, Lieutenant Spade, takes the matter into his own hands. But will it be too late? No, they wait. 